Hey folks, welcome to the jungle. These are giant jungle-like plants, Patocytes, Japonicus, Giganteus. And uh, these things are growing in our deep ravine in the back 40 of our property. And uh, you can see how big they are. I'm standing underneath these things. So they're like giant lily pads on steroids. So let's get up underneath these plants. And uh, this is what it looks like looking up on these plants. So I planted these back in the 1990s. And uh, they really love this moist soil. It's very moist down here. And this is the uh, large growing variety. Apparently the stems are edible. I've never eaten them before, but they're super cool plants. When we look at our living room window and we look into the distance down into this ravine, you can see these beautiful plants growing beside a bald cypress. There's a bald cypress tree, a taxodium. There's Fargesia bamboo in here. And there's a seasonal creek, but uh, really super awesome plants and you can just see how big they are because I am five foot eleven and these guys are taller than me right so there you go and uh, try these in your own garden but remember they can be invasive in your garden so you might want to contain them just like bamboo down here I really don't give a crap if they spread all over the place the more jungle the merrier that's what I always say isn't that pretty awesome you have to love these plants and they're like in the heat too and they are growing in partial shade which is a good thing so they don't burn to a crisp by late summer they're starting to look pretty haggard from the dryness uh, and the uh, like I say lack of rain a lot of times we'll go two three months without rain and it does take its toll on all right guys thanks for watching these are perennial by the way and they do bloom in late winter here and then you get these awesome leaves cheers to you from the Gulf Islands